<laughs> he, he listen. He, he only a lot of times want to work with union actors, and we know what the union does. Look for the union label when you are buying a shirt, dress, or hat. <laughs> Remember, someone is always working. <laughs> Only the real fans gonna know that. Let me explain something to you. Jackie Washington, that Jackie's back needs to be re that it needs to be reintroduced it to, does. to culture. Yes. Jackie Wash Jackie's back needs to be reintroduced to popular culture. It needs to be reintroduced every year. Every single year, it needs to be reintroduced. Every year. It yes. needs to be back in the theaters. It needs to come out July 15th. Every July 15th. In the theater. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. That's a cult classic. It needs to come out. It needs to be streamed. It needs to be on. It don't need to be just on YouTube. It don't. It needs to be for free streamed. Yes. On Netflix. You, uh, YouTube. Prime, YouTube Prime. It Hulu. needs to. Be, that is. That is. That needs to be a part of our. A part of our black staple. Robert Townsend did that. Yes, he did. And here's the gag. Robert Townsend was doing spoofs on movies way before Eddie Murphy. So there's a black director, too. Yes. They could have gave Holly a job. <laughs> <laughs> they what? They could have done what? Gave Holly a job. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. <laughs> oh, they said Jackie's back is on Tubi. Bitch, Jackie. So what's it? I'm did, going to, he, they put her on he put her in Bath. He did put her in Babs. I'm true. going on Jack. I'm going up on Tubi immediately and watch Jackie's back. I love that tonight. Jackie. Jackie's oh, back. You love that movie. I, know I do. That Jackie. I know the I know the line. From back and forth. <laughs> you better know it. You the reason I know that movie. Correct. Because <laughs> the milkman always delivers. <laughs> It wasn't what he delivered. It was what he delivered. <laughs> he he delivered some, some bullshit. <laughs> I know the blocking. Untangra, baby, come here. She 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 sang, and she, she sang, and she sang. <laughs> but we, but right before that, she said she looked like she had a really good time. <laughs> good time. <laughs> she said. Don't you bring those white people around here. You, you know, know they, they all smell, smell like, like wet, wet potato, potato chips. chips. Now get out of here. Hey, play mama. <laughs> wait, hey, play mama. Wait, here's my line. Come here, let me tell you something. <laughs> you think you go to Whitney Houston's house? You gonna see some other bitches award on the wall? <laughs> <laughs> ah, oh god. It's called Jackie's Back, Jackie's Dana Day. It's called Jackie's Back. Bitch. That is starring Jennifer Lewis. Listen, yes, God. Craig, I, I have to tell Have you ever met Jennifer Lewis? I have. Have you spent the day with Jennifer Lewis? I have twice. And I've recited all of these lines to her. She actually called Mark Alton Brown, who wrote Jackie's Back on the phone. And I recited the fucking lines. Then. Craig, is it? Is, is, let me tell you that something. That lady is funny. Spending a day with Jennifer Lewis is an experience. I went to her house during the time when she got her star on the Walk of Fame. Oh. And she was like, yeah. I remember that. I went to her house. I spent all day at that woman's house. Mm -hmm. All day I spent at Jennifer Lewis's house all day. It was an experience. The, the, when she sat and she told me those Aretha stories, is there anything you can share? I will. Because <laughs> <laughs> she had another story you told me we can't talk about. Right. But you when know what she... I'm talking about? No, because the microphone. No, hold on. We'll t no, no, wait. No. But those Aretha stories that she gave me. Listen, I walked in Jennifer Lewis's house and I met myself. Baby. Because if you've ever spent the day with me, it is pure foolishness. Pure. Oh, so it's the same way with her? It's the same way with her. I was so 
Craig, what's the word? Enamored. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> With walking into that woman's home and meeting her and I, I and meeting her myself. Because it was a it was it was a constant storytelling. It was a forgiveness. Now, now back me up on where I can't remember. Uh-huh. Oh, okay. And it was <laughs> it was that. It was laughing. It was foolishness. I remember when she called me on the phone. And it was they, shout out to Shangela for that. She called me on the motherfucking phone. And when I was on the phone with her, I was telling her, did you know I'm going down to Jackie going down to Ken Lock was a Jackie Washington? She said, stay your motherfucking ass out of J- got a Ken Lock. Oh, and I just screamed and hollered. We had a long phone conversation. She forgot, of course. Yeah. I, I wouldn't expect it for her to remember. And then when I got out, she said, oh, yes, yes, yes. Because that is her. It's, it's, y'all have no idea how that day or what that day meant to me to sit with that over that woman's house, drink infused lemonade, because we was high as fuck. Drinking infused limit infused marijuana infused lemonade. We was hiding the motherfucker, like hiding the bitch. And to sit there and be at that woman's house and carry with her all day like that. And then she told us all to get the fuck out. Oh wow. It was a huge get get the fuck out. I got shit to do. Get the fuck out of my house. It was a t- it was I, I never, there's moments in my life that I could go back and I could be like, that's a standout. Yes. That I could go back and be like, God, like, and that was one of those days that I was like, I love that motherfucking woman. You know, she used the same background for um, Bette Midler. That's why Bette Midler was in there. That's why she was in there. A lot of those people that were in there, they had crossed paths professionally at some point. Bro. Yeah. Like if if the, like, I'm telling you, I walked in. I walked in her house, and I met me. Mm-hmm. You, you understand what I'm mm-hmm. saying? Like, mm-hmm. I can see that. I walked in her house, and I met me, and I was just like, her book was great. I loved her book. I'm still huge in Kindle. It was so much shit that was going on in that house. In our conversation, and she says, Yeah, yeah, remind me back where I was. And she Lisa said, Take me back to where I was. I was like, No, girl, you was in. Oh, okay, yes, yes. And so, but when she told me that story about how Aretha ate that food, wait, what was the story, Craig? She said, Whitney Houston told her they, they was just rapping on, um, um, Way to Exhale. Uh-huh. And she said, Whitney Houston told, she said she was going somewhere to go with Aretha. And she said, Aretha told, Whitney told her. Now, Jim, Aretha take that queen shit serious. She takes that queen shit serious. Uh Uh-huh. So just know that. Right. I went, and and when she said the way Aretha had piled that food up on her plate, and she said, yes, queen, eat. And she said, you see it. Bitch, I could have. I could have perished on the spot. <laughs> Listen, in her book, she talks about how Whitney... Oh, Preacher's Wife. I'm sorry. Yeah, Preacher's, preacher's wife. wife. Yeah. So in her book, she talked about how Whitney overdosed on Preacher's Wife. That never... I don't know if you all ever heard of that, heard that, but it never came out. I never heard it. And when I read that book... Well, I listened to the audio. Because like to hear her read it, you know, all her stuff... It was interesting to hear it, but she talked about how Whitney had actually overdosed on that set. Craig. Or while they were filming. I can't say it was on the set, but yeah. while they were filming. Craig, that I gotta I gotta go back to her. She cause she's the mother of black Hollywood. Yeah. But bitch, when she told me the way Aretha piled her plate up, Myrtle. <laughs> Craig, she said Aretha had that plate in her hand. And I it, can I can believe it. And it was like this, and it was piled up with food. <laughs> I can believe it. I can believe it. And she it. said, yes, yeah, queen, eat this. She said, <laughs> she said Aretha, you see it. And she finished uh, it? And she said, because nobody wouldn't eat, they waited until Aretha got there. Nobody ate no food. They had to wait until Aretha got there. Oh, wow. Oh, for real? Yes. And Aretha, Aretha came through, and she motherfucking loaded her plate up. <laughs> what I tell you, that took me away. She didn't finish it, though. 
Oh, they say it was done. She said Aretha done that plate. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you better know it. <laughs> Baby, she said Aretha done done that plate. <laughs> I'll put that 30 second on here. <laughs> okay, hold on. I got it. Put the 30 second on Craig, but Craig has a. I, I need to confirm. Confirm with me about something. Go ahead. Yeah, yeah, so we conferred. Yeah. We can't you discuss, we can't that, discuss that part. No. <laughs> can't never let that go on until the girls are gone. <laughs> right, until right. all the girls. Right, 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 right. All of them. Oh, God. You can't let that go. <laughs> <laughs> That's something I got to take with me. <laughs> oh, my God. That is too oh funny. Oh, my God.